I'm Nick Korlick with Minard's Leisure World, and I'm really quite excited to show you, and give you a sneak preview anyway, of the Solitude, the 2016 Solitude 369RL. I'm excited about this because we've been selling these now, this is our third year for them. Last year was the first year that they brought out this particular floor plan, and it was my first Solitude that I sold, and I've been so excited about it because we've had excellent reviews on it. So now, as we're going through it, a couple things on the front. High gloss laminate. I've even brought my list because I want to show you to make sure I don't miss anything. This one has its generator prepped. It has six point hydraulic auto level on it. As we work our way back, it has the power awning, of course, lighted power awning. You'll notice the frameless windows. The frameless windows are double pane on this coach. When we get to the side here, you're, the storage capacity is second to none. They make this on a, on a drop frame. They didn't do this drop frame. You would have a storage compartment that would stop from here and go up. So look at all the extra space that you have to haul your goodies in. Aluminum steps. No rust going to happen on this. This has two and a quarter inch walls, which gives it R11 value in the walls, plus it gives you R40 in the ceiling. Enclosed underbelly, heated tanks, and besides just the basic heated tanks, we've got an option with the two 12-volt heaters on this, so that uh, you're going to have electric heaters on the tanks as well. So if you're heading south for this in the, with this in the wintertime, you can use it throughout the way. Come on inside. We're inside the 369RL Solitude. First thing you'll notice is a huge fridge, 18 cubic foot of fridge, and it's the dual fridge. So you're going to find that you'll love the, the, the woodwork that, that is on this coach, the countertops, the uh, solid surface countertops, and all of the space. Right in front of this one we have a dishwasher for those nights that dad doesn't want to do the dishes. As we get to the pantry, pretty well a walk-in pantry, but check out the convenience for this. You've got the drawers that will come right out and so there's no reaching into the back way down here where you could even put the big pots and pans down in here if you so desire. It has storage space in the island, the big space up top here. Got to show you this because people comment on this as well. Huge sink on one side, like lots of room to do dishes as well as just the drying area. And we're in the back of the coach. You've got the entertainment sitting center right across from the chairs. These have the recliners, of course, the theater seating, have the cup holders, which, which suit every purpose of life, as well as a place to put your popcorn if you so desire to keep it for later. People like the concept that you have it right across from the TV. Watch the game right through there. This is wide enough, the couch is wide enough that you can lay right down on it as well. This is a king-size trifold bed. So you can roll that out and you can have lots of space if somebody wants us to spend a weekend with you. Park side, loads of windows, all dual frame, and it deadens the sound as well as it keeps it cooler in the summertime. You can have your activities going on outside while somebody's inside prepping the food, they can still be watching what's going on out there. Right at the front, more storage for you. You can use this as a secondary pantry or putting the plates and everything and you've got lots of space for it and they're deep enough to put plates in where some of them don't have that space. Plug-ins under here that you can put your coffee pot and your toaster if you so desire if you didn't want to have it by the stove but the other thing it has it's got a USB port here and a plug-in for AC for charging your cell phones. Come on upstairs. Okay. The bathroom. As you're looking, that, that's a two-person shower, lots of room, lots of height for you, and you can see that you can even adjust the shower head. Lots of storage for, for linens and towels, etc. Now we're into the bedroom. Lots of height. You can see that has, has second air conditioning in this particular coach. The king-size bed. As you have a look at that, like it's got lots of space. In fact, we should have turned these on so that you can see that a little bit better, but there's lots of lights inside for reading and the like. So it's a lot, lot of space around there. And you can still get around the bed 
even as a king size bed here. Now, check this out though. This is like a separate room. You can rent this out on weekends, especially if it's important for your, you to have friends around, or you can store your shoes and all your clothing in here. And again, right up in the corner, it's, uh, it's washer dryer prepped, but lots of space. Right at the foot of the bed, you have a bureau. Again, with drawers, full, full extension drawers on the roller bearings, four drawers. So again, lots and loads and loads of space. And under the bed, this is something unique to, to the solitude. You've got the storage space, which is traditional, but then there's also a place, this is a jewelry box that you can set the jewelry out there. And it's with a black felt that it's not going to fly all over the place, but also you black again with the gold, that beautiful gold that you've got will stand out quite nice. But plus you've got a place to sit on while you're putting your shoes on in the morning. Plus you can store stuff right there for the nifty, huh? So that's the 2016 Solitude 369 RL. RL is rear living room. You've got a beautiful living room here. Things to remember, this is a wider body too that I probably never mentioned. It's 101 inches wide. So you've got an extra six inches of width on the trailer just in the coach side itself, plus you've got the extra slide outs. So you've got more room, bigger structure, heavier duty structure, and just a luxurious feel. So call at 1-877-842-3288. I'm Nick Korlick.